All right, hey Cancer. So I'm doing um, a read for you guys that are dealing with somebody who can't seem to commit to you and the situation. So you guys have been seeing each other for a little while, casually dating, just not moving forward in the relationship. So basically we're gonna see if this person is wasting your time. All right, so we're gonna get your energy. What energy is Cancer in? The Cancer that's here for this read, what energy are they in? So I feel like you're in this energy of wanting to move forward Right, you might feel like at this point that <clears throat> you could just be um, hanging around for sex, and you want to move forward. You want to you want to see um, the situation progress progress. So let's see what energy your person is in. We got hangman on their end, which is that pause. They don't know what to do. And then we got death. I feel like they're just in this mode where they don't know whether to transition from where you guys are at now and, and to taking it to the next step, right? So what is this person's situation? What is this person's situation? Seven of Swords. So I feel like... I almost feel like they're being... Um, I feel like they're showing you this, Knight of Cups energy, but I feel like they're being... Uh, I feel like they're hiding something. The Seven of Swords is about... Um, lies cheating manipulation um you know it's a stolen heart card but then it's coming out coupled with the nine of cups the knight of cups which is supposed to be about love and um dating and it's a positive energy and i almost feel like they're manipulating yeah i feel like this person is just kind of manipulating the situation because i, I almost feel like they're they're not over a, the past. They're not over something from the past, a situation from the past. I almost wonder if you're um, like a rebound. It doesn't matter how long you've been together. Like they want happiness, but I feel like they're dwelling on something from the past. And I feel like they're kind of given a false sense of the Knight of Cups, but this is what they want. So what is the runaround? What's this runaround? What's the runaround in this situation? What does this person keep telling Cancer? That they can see something new with you. The runaround is uh, going to be what they keep telling you, but they're not doing. What What is this person? I feel like they keep telling you that they want to commit. That they're going to. With the Ace of Swords. I feel like they keep telling you, yeah, this is going to happen, but it's not. I, I feel like. It's almost like, just take our time. Let's just take our time. Why do we got to rush things? What is the runaround? I feel like this person is, they're keeping you at bay. I feel like they're this is them right here and they're tied to something of the past, but I feel like they're keeping you at bay. It's like they can't really, they can't commit themselves to you, but they keep telling you that this is where it's going to lead to. This is where it's going to go. Just keep, just hang back. Just hang back. It's going to happen. Why? But don't be so pushy. Don't push. Hang on loosely. For whatever that, that means. What is their intention with cancer? Their intention. Alright, so what I'm seeing is... For the hangman that came out, you guys are going to come out of this little pause period. All right. Their intention, 
Um, I feel like the, the cycle of them being in this holding on to the past situation is what I feel like. I feel like they're coming out of that. All right. They're going to be more successful when it comes to you. I feel like um, pinnacles, those are about commitments. All right. So I do... Um, I do see their intention as closing out the cycle that needs to be closed out. I just don't feel like they're telling you the reason why they're not moving forward. And it's because of a past situation. Should cancer stick around? Should you stick around? We have the two of swords, which speaks of blockages, the three of hearts, which is heartache and heartbreak, and then the sun card. And I almost feel like what your team is saying is this person, I feel like their long-term intention with you is to um, make something happen with you, but don't stick around while this person is trying to sort out their, their heartbreak. You know what I mean? Like keep moving forward. Don't, don't feel like you're tied to the situation. Don't feel like you, this situation um, it's like in order for this to progress, you can't be, um, hanging around a stagnant person. And I feel like this person does have love for you, but you're, I feel like what your team is saying is you're going to find happiness when you pursue it, but don't stick around waiting for somebody who's not available quite yet. Cause I, I, you know, whatever happens, I feel like you and this person there, you're going to come back around. If cancer sticks around as of now, what's the outcome? The seven of wands, this person's still going to act guarded. Yeah. I feel like if you stick around now, it's, it's going to end. It's not going to end the way you want it to because this person, they still have some... They still got some stuff that they're, um, they're, this is nostalgia thinking about the past. They're, they're, they're still thinking about the past. And if you were to stick around and wait with this person, it's not going to end well because what you're doing is you're putting your life on hold. So I feel like what you should tell this person is, um, well, let me just pull the advice. It's not supposed to be about what I, my thought, what is the advice? Yeah. Look at So your advice. Tens are about endings. Okay. Um, but the situation is not going to close out. We got judgment. So it's going to come back around. But I feel like your your team is saying, let this person work on themselves and, and you work on, on yourself. And if you are identifying anything within this person that relates to this, um, it's like, I'm going to go do my own thing while you figure your stuff out. I don't want to be kept on the hook. All right. So you work on yourself. I'm going to work on myself. And then we'll come back around when we're both or when, you know, you're more suited or ready for um, a solid, stable commitment. Right. So what's coming towards cancer um, if they move forward with their own life? You got the three of wands. I feel like that's incoming news. Yeah, what's to come? Look at some self-reflection. Um, and then a new, um, more stable, solid uh, beginning can approach. And I, I feel like it is with this person, but I feel like if you're, you're kind of questioning them saying, you know, what's, what are we doing? You know, I, I, I just feel like if you, if you hang around, you're not going to get any benefit from it. Um, but when you leave and you kind of do the self-reflection, I, the situation is going to come back around, but I feel like your team is just saying, don't hold on to somebody that's not holding on to you. Right. How does this person feel about cancer? How do they feel about cancer? Not, uh, King of Wands. So I feel like they're they're very passionate. They feel very passionate about you. They're attracted to you. Look, at, they have this deep soul connection, but I feel like you're actually dealing with somebody who's pretty emotionally level-headed. I can't give you me right now. 
but just hang back. And what I feel like your team is saying is don't hang back. Let this person do their thing and it's going to come back around and don't let them you don't let them see they they do they love you but they're they're they like they want to they want to pursue this with you but they know that they can't right now okay so um i feel like you know what you're you're i feel like your team is right there saying you know what just uh, leave to focus on yourself or, or walk away from it. Don't wait on anybody and don't let them string you along, but focus on self and then watch the situation, um, unfold naturally. Like it needs to, like you want it to. All right, cancer. I'm going to leave, leave this right here for you guys. Hopefully you guys will let me know if this is resonating with you.